मैडम स्टार्ट कर मैडम अभी स्टार्ट कर yes uh, i will start kariba so uh, i am audible na yes okay uh, so hello everyone i am susri sangita sara academic consultant and i welcome to you all in another class of tribal studies odisha state open university today we will learn about the tribal ethnicity and identity which is our course 3 and block 2 this blog is going to teach by most talented and social activist dr mehul chohan he is a multi talented personality he did several study on development studies and trained many tribal women in the field of their skill development program taking a lot of initiative to aware women about their health hygiene and sanitization he is not only a good researcher social activist but also a good academician he served many university school and colleges in different disciplines now i like to welcome uh, to you all and request our resource person dr mehul chohan to take over the session sir please thank you madam and good morning to everyone so today the session the topic that i have been allocated we would be seeing tribal identity we would be seeing tribal ethnicity and identity and under this we will be covering three units or we will be covering it into three parts so first i would start with the first part here we would first deal with the objectives and the introduction of the basic concepts basically in this unit we are going to try and understand what is the principle of equality we'll take it in details what is the different definitions given for equality what is the basic distinction between equality and between inequality and differences inequality and differences when we speak we have to look it into the context of the tribal people and tribal community also we would try to see that how this concept of equality inequality and difference has come up in relation to various tribal problems sir please unmute sir mic mic i just got the message to switch it off no 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 it's for learners only okay oh, that is what i was thinking is what happened so now when we see this different tribes in indian society they are culturally different from one another ame jodi dekhiba sanskrutik rupare आम जिते ट्राइब्स गुड़ाक अच्छा समस्त संस्कृति भिन्न भिन्न रही गोटे यूनिफर्मिटीटा ना एंड दैट इज व्वाय देर हाज बीन ट्राइबल डिमांड्स फॉर कल्चरल रेकग्निशन एंड कंटिन्यूटी विद इन दि इंडियन नेशन स्टेट देर हाज बीन वेरियस टाइम्स अ वेरी चैलेंजिंग सिचुएशन फॉर दि गवर्नमेंट फॉर दिविल सोसायटी सिंस पास्ट मोर देन सिक्स डेकेट्स 
now this concept what we speak of equality a concept ta achi amar foundation value ehar asi chi ajiro modern society ru today's modern society and the principle which this modern society has created of equality states that everybody should be treated legally with equal rights equal respect regardless tankor caste kon religion kon region kon race kon eita jitte bhi differences achi eha ko amaku na dekhi ki samastam ko equal kimba equality prism ru dekhi ba ku padibo jodi ame eita dekhu chu eita sato kotha je amaro aji jitte bhi modern nation kimba states achi because we have grown as a society we have grown as a country we have grown as a civilization and as people so we see that there is a great degree of diversity and when we speak of diversity amaro nijorohi desare kete diversity guda ko rohi chi these diversities bahut bele diversity pai ame kete problem guda ko madhya face karu chu so equality which means that we have to that everybody should be treated in a similar fashion in a same manner while diversity means that there are considerable definite socio as well as cultural differences among the population so that is why sometimes it happens that sometimes some communities are not uh, treated fairly they are being treated unfairly tahele kon hochi amaro equality ro jo amaro concept achi sei concept ta eithi violate hei poruchi that is why if we see traditional societies jaha ki amaro paramparik societies guda ko achanti they are characterized by got a social order which is based on hierarchy groups individuals ta pare subordinate thanti previous class re mu jaha koithili amar jo tribes achi tribes ro chieftains mane madhya thanti mane superior achanti se mane jodi ame pre modern india ro katha ta dekhiba so we find that in this society we find that the caste system had divided the society into the lower as well as higher caste which was based on which criteria of course the criteria of purity and pollution so what was it it was considered that people belonging to the higher caste they are placed in a higher social hierarchy and in medieval europe they had also established a system jemiti amara eithi am jebe ame india katha ta kahuchu ame kahuchu je society has been divided into lower caste as well as higher caste europe re bhi sei bhaliya division kara jai thila se samay re and this was divided into three main parts the first one was known as clergy second one was known as nobility and third one was known as commons jebe ame क्लर्जी विषय रे कहू छु जे में हमें क्लर्जी विषय रे कहू छु वी विल स्टिक विद द अंबेडकर स्लाइड व्हेन आई टेल वी विल गो फर्दर राइट नाउ विल स्टिक बिकॉज़ आई हैव जस्ट पुट बुलेटेड पॉइंट्स एंड देन आई एम एक्सप्लेनिंग इन डिटेल्स क्लर्जी माने कोनो हमर जे जेमिति एठी मंदिर को जे देखो रे करंती वी कॉल देम एज प्रीस्ट्स पंडित्स सो सिमिलरली इन यूरोप द थ्री स्ट्राटा वर फर्स्ट वाज क्लर्जी हु वर द रिलीजियस पीपल मेन एंड वुमेन second was nobility nobility ro mane kono you all might have heard uh, duchess of sussex or duke of sussex or duchess duke eita sabu amaro ho chanti nobility au commons mane kono jemiti ame mane loko seithi bi sei bhaliya sadharan loko je ho chile se mane commons ko ha jao chile so eita ho chi amaro society ro division jaha hei chi ta pare jodi ame dekhiba ame ame eita kohantu je india re there have been number of social movements jemiti ki bhakti movement hai chi hinduism re jo thi ki amaro supremacy of the priest class or the brahmins class that is there and getting social equality for the lower caste also there has been efforts that are being made similarly bahut efforts guda ko hai chi islam re bhi christianity re bhi in the history jaha dwara ki greater equality samastam ko bhitare ase but none of these movements were successful mane medieval period re bhi ame dekhile ei movements guda ko successful hei parile nahi jaha ki ame hinduism ki christianity ki islamic societies re ame dekhi chu 
so we can also see that traditionally our indian society is seen as an unusually hierarchical society sabu jagare gote hierarchy achi varna pratha you might have heard about the varna pratha we have different kinds of varnas so not all traditional societies were as pluralistic as modern society jebe ame aji ro katha kariba vartaman ro katha kariba let us say of 2020 the kind of pluralism that we see today the same thing was not there in all the traditional societies but there were different communities say somewhere au se mane samaste coexisted in one society and that is the reason that we are here today if all would have fought all would have tried to wipe out one another we would have not seen the light of the day so there was no pluralism like that which is there today but still they coexisted with one another and these communities had place in the social structure and interaction with others which depended on their positions taankar society re relative position ta kon achi sei hisab re hierarchy ta prepare kara gola aur hierarchy anujay se mane interaction karu chile jodi ame gote ebe scholar ro definition ta dekhiba fernival je ki omen re lekhitile 2004 ro publication eta achi se kahi chanti je situation in a colonial society से डिस्क्राइब जे ईच ग्रुप होल्ड्स इट्स ओन रिलीजन ओन कल्चर ओन आइडियाज एंड वेज दे मीट ओनली इन द मार्केट प्लेस डिफरेंट सेक्शंस ऑफ कम्युनिटी लिव साइड बाय साइड बट दे लिव सेपरेटली विद इन द सेम यूनिट नाउ व्हेन वी स्पीक ऑफ दिस डेफिनेशन इट आल्सो अप्लाइज टू कॉलोनीज मान ब्रिटिश रोनी अच्छी तापरे आउ इंडिया रे जदी आमे देखिबा पोर्तुगीज कॉलोनी थिला तापरे आउ हमरो पंडिचेरी साइड रे भी फ्रेंच कॉलोनीज थिला किछि डैनिश कॉलोनीज डैनिश माने भी आसी थिले आप मे माने देखिबा जे जो हमरो कॉलोनियल सोसाइटी अछि जा से दैट मे बी इवन इन अफ्रीका दैट ईच ग्रुप सब ग्रुप रो गोटे रिलीजन अछि गोटे कल्चर अछि गोटे आइडिया अछि आउ से माने रहु छथि आउ से माने मीट करू छथि समस्त मार्केट प्लेस को एंड वी फाइंड दैट दिस इनइक्वालिटी बिटवीन कम्युनिटीज एंड डिफरेंशियल ट्रीटमेंट फॉर सम कम्युनिटीज एट द कॉस्ट ऑफ अदर्स मेजर प्रॉब्लम क्रिएट न कर सोसाइटीज डिड नॉट एक्सेप्ट इक्वालिटी और डेमोक्रेसी एज अ वैल्यू डेमोक्रेसी तो आम एसी कौन आम पूर्वतन काल रु डेमोक्रेसी थी ना डेमोक्रेसी नाला डेमोक्रेसी हेज कम विद कमिंग इन ऑफ़ दी कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन सो दस द रोल ऑफ़ द स्टेट वाज नाउ टू मेंटेन सोशल ऑर्डर हार्मोनिक सिस्टम दरकार पड़े देख लु कनसेप्ट अफ इक्वाटी यहाँ कि गोटे मडर्ण कनसेप्ट जहाँ आसी इक्वाटी इन मडर्ण पीरियड जदि कह इल्व कौटी है यूरोप इवल्व है विशेष कर you might have read in the french revolution in england and united states and that is why when the french revolution took place the american war of independence took place say the violent expressions hela clashes hela revolt hela a traditional social order finds they, they wanted to have an egalitarian order and that is why lot of privileges of the aristocracy and the clergy were removed mane jo purohit mane thile jo priest mane thile jo aristocratic bado lok mane thile tankor privileges european society ru bahar kari diya gola so they all were treated as equal to have a equal system similarly jebe amara american constitution bana hela after the war they included the bills of rights which ensured equality to citizen au ei ta ko koriba pai kon kara gala seithi they सेपरेटेड चर्च चर्च रर्थ कौन हूँ धर्म वेस्टर्ण सोसाइटी रे चर्च रर्थ हूँ धर्म आउ स्टेट हूँ गवर्नमेंट ए दीटा को दे पाइफरकेटेड इट दे मेड इट एज डिफरेन्ट एंटीटीज टू अवॉइड एनी फॉर्म ऑफ डिस्क्रिमिनेशन अमंग्स इट सिटीजन बिकॉज़ ऑफ देयर रिलीजन कहीं जदि गोटे धर्म रोक मेजरीटी रे थे देर व्वज एप्रिहेनशन इफ स्टेट फलोज दैट रिलीजन देर मे बी डिस्क्रिमिनेसन अगेन्स्ट द 
others who do not follow that particular religion this was the school of thought jaha ki amaro equality in modern period re asi chi tei hisab re ame dekhiba je amaro early 20th century we all are now a part and parcel ame jodi kahiba 20th century ki new millennials kahiba ame eta dekhu chu ame 20th century dekhu chu ame 19th century bi kete jan thilu je jebe ame women when we speak of women we find that women had to struggle till early 20th centuries even to get their voting rights and the afro americans became equal to their white counterparts only after civil war aji ame kahu chu je america such a great country rights the human rights away sabu kintu seithi bi gote ei ranga bhedra niti thila jaha ki amo desh re ame dekhi chu that is based on the color of the skin so jo tankara african mulor americans thile se man ku sadeva discrimination ta face kariba ku padu chu so that is why we see that large section of societies were excluded from ambit of equal treatment be it women slaves colonized people and outsiders when we speak of colonized people amo nijo example bi hebo jebe amo upare colonization thila videshi shasan thila kono ame sei privileges ta pauthilu jaha ki ame aji pauchu aji ame train ro first ac coach re travel kari paruchu kono sei time re ame kari pare thanta amo colonial masters mane karante ame to kari paribu nahi so you this is just a very small simple example to express the discrimination and the evolution of process of equality our 19th or 20th century re jaha ame dekhu chu je political and legal equality jaha ame kahu chu without social and economic equality was futile aur eta bahut important achi jodi jano ko ame kahiba that we are giving you political and legal equality you have the right to vote and legally you are equal but if that person is not socially and economically equal he will not be able to enjoy those privileges hence making people socially and economically equal is also important that is why you see we speak everywhere socio economic development why do, why is it said because it is a key socio economic development is key to socio economic equality which is a milestone in bringing political and legal equality so when we see this definition of uh, equality what various authors have said be it ernest backer he said that equality is a protein notion ए बे एठी ए जो वर्ड प्रोटीन आसी छि तार अर्थ होउ छि जे ट्रेंडिंग और एबल टू चेंज माने समय सह सेटा चेंज हे चालिबो आजकली यंग जनरेशन यू ऑल मस्ट बी यूजिंग द वर्ड एटा ट्रेंड रे अछि एटा ट्रेंडिंग अछि सोशल मीडिया रे कोन से दैट इट हैज द एबल टू चेंज इट विल गो ऑन चेंजिंग एंड सो इज द केस ऑफ इक्वालिटी इट चेंजेस इट्स शेप्स एंड अज्यूम्स न्यू फॉर्म्स विद अ रेडी फैसिलिटी सो इक्वालिटी सहज अर्थ एटा ना दैट डज नट सिंपली मीन सिमिलर ट्रीटमेंट टू ऑल सो ट्रीटिंग अनइक्वल इक्वली विल बी एज मच इन जस्टिस एज ट्रीटिंग इक्वल्स अनइक्वली सो दिस इज अ वेरी सटल अंडरस्टैंडिंग दिस अ वेरी सटल अंडरस्टैंडिंग ऑफ दिस लाइन बिकॉज इट इज बेस्ड ऑन द फैक्ट दैट एवरी इंडिविजुअल पॉजिस डिफरेन्ट कैपासीटीज एंड दे प्रड्यूस डिफरेन्ट outcomes pratyek lokoro different capacity achi different outcome achi au seti pai seiti amaku eita dekhi baku padibo how this concept of equality comes it would be trending it would be protein so similarly there were various other authors also who have expressed their understanding of equality saying that the purpose of the society would be frustrated both badhiya example achi jodi if we see at the outset if the nature of a mathematician met with identical response with that of a bricklayer bujile jo nature achi mathematician ko jodi ami ta ko identical kari debu response with that of a bricklayer it would be wrong to relate equality with the same treatment of all here can there be equality of the outcomes that are going to come no they will have different outcomes just as each person has different qualities and credentials so we see that 
this means if we take up the definitions of last key that no special privilege kaha ko kichi special privilege deba nahi equal opportunity samastang ko deba ko achi so that you give opportunity for education you give opportunity that talent comes out give social benefits no restriction based on any extraneous factors that is very important similarly if we see turner eta last ki ro tapare ami turner ro concept dekhiba turner kouchi the fundamental equality of persons he again repeats what lasky has said about equal opportunity and that equal opportunity has to be given further he also says equality of outcomes is achievement of a given set of positive circumstances je bhi positive circumstances rahibo eta asibo seti pai when we speak of inequality and difference when we speak of inequality and difference modern communities have greater differentiation based on a number of criteria ajiro amaro ja modern unnato developed civilized society ame kahu chu amku ei thare ame dekhi ba bahut guda criteria achi jaha ki inequality aur difference srishti karuchi aur dekha jauchi jemiti ki income race ownership sexual orientation etc so we see that it is these different categories that have also resulted into differentiation in modern day societies although there has been minimalization of differentiation based on the criteria of sex and age so today we speak of gender equality gender parity unesco concept which we had studied in unit 3 of the first session so that is what that is to bring about a sense of equality between the sexes for instance usa re dark skin jaha ki ame black lokon ko kohuthilu was seen as ugly till 1960s 1960s bahu duror katha nahi jodi ame dekhiba amar independence 1947 1960s kichi decades agro so so seen ugly till 1960s when change in ideas of beauty altered sundarta kono taro definition ta change hela or black is beautiful emerge hela so you might have heard about a very famous black model naomi campbell say je be asile this concept of black is beautiful became more reinforced with the passage of time social inequality and natural inequality when we speak of this we find that there are two kinds of inequality among the human species one which is called as natural or physical because that is established by nature and consists of different age health bodily strength qualities of mind soul ame samaste ame samastankara eta bhinna bhinna thibo why this is natural my health my bodily strength my qualities of mind or soul may not be like of yours and yours may not be like mine this is natural and another may be called as moral or political inequality because that is based on the convention mane jaha ame establish korichu or at least authorized by the consent of time as per time what has been established so there are Uh, sociologists who have put forward various kinds of uh, examples like for instance measuring intelligence quotient in united states they found that the whites on an average have higher score than the black so does that means whites are naturally more intelligent than the blacks can income gap between the communities be explained by higher intelligence of white but एटा को बुझा गला जे इंटेलिजेंस इज प्रोडक्ट इंटेलिजेंस केमिति आसुची जणे यो लोकन को भीतर इट इज प्रोडक्ट ऑफ बोथ जेनेटिक एंड एनवायरमेंट फैक्टर जीन्स जीन्स आउ एनवायरमेंट सोशल बैकग्राउंड ऑफ इंडिविजुअल इन्फ्लुएंसेस इंडिविजुअल रो आई क्वेश्चन आई आई क्यू से को बढ़िया बैकग्राउंड रे बडो हेई छी से को बढ़िया बैकग्राउंड रे इन्फ्लुएंसेस हेई छी सो दैट ऑल आर फैक्टर्स दैट influence an intelligent quotient 
so there have been some of the groups which are discriminated because of the natural differences ja ki bartman ye jo slide achi you can see this men and women racial differences traditionally ame dekhiba generally physical uh, men are considered to be physically stronger than women there is no biological evidence to show that women are incapable of doing tasks that men do yet it is often felt that men are better suited to manage outside work while women are better suited to do house work kintu ethi as a anthropology students jodi gote bhalo mane tribal study students bhalo observation karicho if you are coming from rural background chaso re jete bhi difficult work hue majority of all the difficult work physical work across the globe you will see who does it women does it women are stronger but then what is the notion this is the notion similarly if you see racial differences eta got a european justification for colonization asila je white race was more advanced more evolved than other races therefore had a role in civilizing them माने एटा भाव भी देयर वाज अ इंटरनेशनल थॉट जे व्हाइट रेसेस बहुत इंटेलिजेंट अछंती आउ सेति पय से माने समस्तन को रूल करिवे आउ सेटा हला ईस्ट इंडिया कंपनी को कोन कोहा जाउथिलो नेवर सेटिंग सन देन देयर इज दैट दैट इज व्हाट वाज रेशियल डिफरेंसेस देन देयर इज कल्चर एंड इनइक्वालिटी व्हेन वी स्पीक ऑफ कल्चर एंड इनइक्वालिटी द क्वालिटीज यूज्ड टू जज the relative position of group in comparison to other groups as identified because of their social as well as cultural processes so we will see that all knowledge ideas although to different degrees are bound to a location within social structure and historical processes gote social structure re rahibo gote historical process re rahibo कहीं से से एरिया को कन्फाइन है कि रही यूरोपियन कल्चर इज डिफरेंट ईस्ट इंडिया ईस्टर्न कल्चर इज डिफरेंट वेस्टर्न कल्चर इज डिफरेंट ता भितर यू विल डिवाइडेड अगेन सेवरल सेट ऑफ कल्चर्स सो नाउ फर्दर टेकिंग वी विल गो टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड यार परवर्त स्लाइड ये नाउ विल बी हि जेब आम इनइक्वाटी एंड डिफरेन्स इन इंडिया कह चु पर्टिकुलरली आमे जेबे ट्राइबल कॉन्टेक्स्ट रे कहउछु आमरो जेते भी पॉलिटिकल लीडर्स थिले देशरो इंडिपेंडेंस परे फ्रॉम ब्रिटिश रूल दे अंडरस्टूड द चैलेंज ऑफ क्रिएटिंग एन इगालिटेरियन सोशल ऑर्डर इन अ डीपली रूटेड हायरार्कियल सोसाइटी आवर सोसाइटी इज अ डीपली रूटेड हायरार्कियल सोसाइटी सो डॉक्टर अंबेडकर जे हम भारत रत्न से आर्किटेक्ट हेले आमरो इंडियन कॉन्स्टिट्यूशन रो and he described the challenge faced by indian democracy je bharatar ganatantram ko sammukhare kono challenge achi jebe ame inequality and differences kahuchu indian context re aur bishesh gurutva dei ki ame jebe tribal context re kahuchu so there what he said is that we must make our political democracy a social democracy as well kai ki agare mu koili ki ame jodi political aur legal equality anuchu पहले आमको सोशल आउ इकोनॉमिक इक्वालिटी भी आने को पड़ो ना से फलित हो पार ना बाबा साहेब भी यही पॉलिटिकल डेमोक्रेसी यूजलेस रेत पर्यत सोशल डेमोक्रेसी आसब ना विशेषकर आम इंडियान कंटेक्सट जब आम कहूँ तार अर्थ यहाँ हूँ जब आम सोशल डेमोक्रेसी अर्थ कौन सोशल डेमोक्रेसी अर्थ हूँ इट मीनस अ वे अफ लाइफ where we recognize the fundamental principles of liberty equality and fraternity as the principles of life liberty equality and fraternity are not to be treated as separate items in a trinity they are not diff three different things in a trinity they form a union of trinity in the sense that to diverse i'm quoting this what he has written from the text one from other is to defeat the very purpose of democracy au seti pai 26 january 1950 we are going to enter into a life of contradictions in politics we will have equality and in social and economic life we will have inequality au aaj bhi ame dekhu chu politics re equality achi samastankar voting right achi yes but 
कौन आज आम ये समस्ते सोशली एंड इकोनोमिकली आर वी इक्वल अक्रस द कंट्री सोशली एंड इकोनोमिकली नो वी आर नट इक्वल अक्रस द कंट्री सो इन पॉलिटिक्स वी विल हैव इक्वालिटी एंड इन सोशल एंड इकोनॉमिक लाइफ वी विल हैव इन इक्वालिटी एंड इन अवर सोशल एंड इन इकोनॉमिक लाइफ वी शैल बाय रीजन ऑफ अवर स्ट्रक्चर कंटिन्यू टू डिनाय द प्रिंसिपल ऑफ वन मैन वन वैल्यू and this is the biggest challenge that we are facing simple example we have migrant crisis hai na ab this is a migrant crisis hai na so many kitne hardships face kare na and particularly you will see the migrants come coming back to states like orissa jharkhand east indian states am purva bharat or state pray bahut guda state are tribal community mro madhye achanti so there is no equality सोशल आउ इकोनॉमिक इक्वालिटी नाही से माने बेसी हार्डशिप्स फेस आउ दैट इज व्हाई इंडियन स्टेट्स रेस्पोंस टू ट्राइबल सिचुएशन जब आम देखा बहुत प्रोजेस गुड़ाक कर कन्स्टिट्यूशन आर्टिकल चौदह पंद्रह षोल ग्रांट इन एड एंड वी हेड स्टडीड इन प्रिवियस क्लास अबाउट प्रिवेटिंग डिस्क्रिमेसन प्रोटेक्टिव आर्टिकल दे नेशनल कमिशन फॉर शेड्यूल्ड ट्राइब्स पंडित नेहरू जोटा हमरो पांच शील और फाइव पॉइंट्स कोरिथिले जहां की वेरियर एल्विन तंको ना सुनी थी बो वेरी बिग एंथ्रोपोलॉजिस्ट वेरियर एल्विन बने ही चले जहां द्वारा एडवोकेसी करा गला मिनिमल गवर्नेंस ओल्पो गवर्नेंस एंड ऑटोनॉमी दिया जाओ ट्राइबल माने निजो जीवनटा निजो हिसाब रे व्यतीत करो शेड्यूल 6 शेड्यूल 7 तापर पैसा आसीला पंचायती Raj, Panchayat extension scheduled areas amendment. So all these things are very important, and you can count these things as Indian state's response to tribal situation. Similarly, Indian market and civil society's response to tribal situation. They kill it. Aji tribes no more isolated from non-tribes. Aji tribes non-tribes mix hai jai chhanti. Contact got a tribe or non-tribe ro contact a body learning. Kani migration. कहीं फोर्स्ड डिस्प्लेसमेंट एटा सब हेई चली छी हमर सोसाइटी रे सो देयर हैव बीन वेरियस स्टीरियोटाइप्स अबाउट ट्राइबल्स एंड व्हाट आर दिस स्टीरियोटाइप्स व्हेन यू रीड द टेक्स्ट दैट हैज बीन प्रोवाइडेड टू यू फॉर इंस्टेंस वी हैव आवर ब्रदर्स एंड सिस्टर्स इन द नॉर्थ ईस्ट हु हैव मंगोलाइड फीचर्स एंड दे डू नॉट लुक Like the central or you know, mainland Indian features, and they are called as Chinese. So this is derogatory. They are called as chinky. This is derogatory. This is a kind of discrimination. Again, what I said about that tribal women are considered physically strong and sturdy. At the same time, they are seen as docile and they are obedient to their patrons. These are certain stereotypes. Many times we see that tribal women are seen as promiscuous why women body is seen as a site for cultural domination jaha ki amaro purushvadi society patriarchal society achi our popular representation in films ame kon dekhu bollywood re hero achi heroine achi jungle re gole tribal mane tanku dhori ki nahi gole tanku bandhi dele and then they tried to kill them or they ran away and then or they were sacrificed so what is this tribes are depicted as wearing minimal clothes and interested mainly in drinking and dancing so all this what i am speaking are popular stereotypes about the tribes this is a chapter you will find that there are six points all what i am speaking right now and north you have to see that northeast in men and women women are often not recruited for jobs that have public profile so why they, because it is said that no they do not have a indian look although this stereotype is now getting broken gradually because if you go to delhi you go to bangalore you go to bombay jete mahanagar re ami jiba ami dekhiba tankaro assimilation process ta ebe badhi chi kintu ami jodi onnyanya jaga bisay re koile ebe bi tankaro ete assimilation ta hei ni so the examples are found a examples jaha ami dekhilu there are six examples such you have to go through these examples to understand the various concepts which we have discussed about inequality and differences in the tribal context
तापर आमे नेक्स्ट स्लाइड को जीबा वी गो टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड यस एटा इंडियन स्टेट रो रिस्पोंस जा मु बुझैली इक्वालिटी पाई कॉन्स्टिट्यूशनल सेफगार्ड्स जहा करा जाय छि provisions for recognizing preserving differences i have explained this just now we'll again go to the next slide popular stereotype jo chota stereotype mu koili ki tribes jaha mongolite features achanti tanku ame chinki ki chinese kohu ta chhoda amaro bollywood re tribals ku kemiti portray kara jai chi tribal women are considered to be more physically strong they are also Uh, portrayed women in a very uh, bad state by the patriarchal society so these are all the indian market and civil society's response to the tribal situation we'll go to the next one next slide ha ebe ame bartaman dekhiba ethnic relation conflict out change ta kon achi ethnic relation amaro conflict out change जेबे आमे एथनिसिटी वर्ड व्यवहार करूच व्हेन वी यूज दिस वर्ड एथनिसिटी व्हाट कम्स टू आवर माइंड फर्स्ट इज दैट फैक्ट और स्टेट ऑफ बिलोंगिंग टू अ सोशल ग्रुप एथनिसिटी माने आमे को सोशल ग्रुप को बिलोंग करूच एंड दिस इज ऑफन यूज्ड इन रिलेशन टू ट्राइबल प्रॉब्लम्स इफ यू ऑल आर अ गुड रीडर और अ गुड लिसनर ऑफ न्यूज़ मेनी टाइम्स वी लिसन इन द न्यूज़ दैट देयर इज अ एथनिक कॉन्फ्लिक्ट इन दिस पार्ट ऑफ द वर्ल्ड देयर इज अ एथनिक क्लेंजिंग इन दैट पार्ट ऑफ द वर्ल्ड ethnic problems now how do we deal with these ethnic and uh, these problems over here that we are seeing in this introduction the concept of ethnicity ethnic relations in india ethnicity ro kono theoretical perspective achi ethnicity and nationalism india re kon achi eita sabu ame bartaman ei amaro chapter re ame discuss kariba au seti pai according to this view the modern consciousness has left the tribes as backward and there lies the main cause for tribal problems i mean sada vele bhabi chu je tribals are backwards and that is where the problem lies so people of the so called mainstream often shake their head heads and blame the tribes when they hear about violence in tribal area oh these tribals they are just fighting no but we have to understand what is the concept of ethnicity so basically the word if you see ethnic comes from greek word ethnos meaning nation they saw and it does not mean a political community but people of common descent or kinship jaha ki mu first meaning re explain kareli au latin re ethnicus mane outsider someone who did not belong to the majority community so max weber tanko definition re kahile je ethnic group ta kona ethnic group as that entertains a subjective belief in their common descent mane origin because of similarities of physical type or of customs or both or because of memories of colonization and migration colonization ebam migration so according to weber a definition has come up very beautiful similarly other great researchers like smith a smith describe korile ethnic community ethnic group weber describe korile ethnic community smith describe korile je named human population with a myth of common ancestry tankor ancestral history ta gote common shared memories and cultural elements a link with a history territory or a homeland and a measure of oneness that is solidarity so when we see ethnicity and nationalism in india jeme abe india ro paripekkhya re eta dekhiba 
इंडिया रे एथनिसिटी एंड नेशनलिज्म आर ऑफन इंटरचेंजेबली यूज्ड सो जदी आमे देखिबा नेशनलिज्म ट कोन एहारो डेफिनेशन एटा हो छी एन आइडियोलॉजी बेस्ड ऑन द बिलीफ दैट पीपल विद कॉमन कैरेक्टरिस्टिक्स सच एज लैंग्वेज रिलीजन एंड एथनिसिटी कंस्टिट्यूट ए सेपरेट एंड डिस्टिंक्टिव पॉलिटिकल कम्युनिटी सो हमरो इंडियन नेशनलिस्ट जहां की even before independence always insisted that basis of our nationalism when we speak of indian nationalism is not any particular linguistic or religious community kai ki ame jebe international definitions guda ko dekhilu ame sei thik achi gote belief gote custom kintu jebe ame india ko dekhiba india is not a country where everyone has got one religion we have several religions we have hindus we have muslims we have sikhs we have parsis jains so many so many different religion so amor nationalism ta kono ethnicity and nationalism in india before independence jo spirit ta thila sei ta koila je amor konosi particular linguistic kimba religious community nahi so it was therefore different from european model of nationalism because there was homogeneous community india re kemiti community achi heterogeneous community the civilization model of nation would have enormous diversity of the indian subcontinent amaro gote rajya rahi to kete diversity achi so you see the cultural diversity coastal orissa ru asu asu western orissa re diversity hai jauchi orissa ru chatisgarh palaile diversity chatisgarh ru madhya pradesh diversity madhya pradesh ru delhi diversity delhi ru kashmir diversity so you see the wide plethora of diversity that we have in our country and similarly the tribal population are part of the diversity of india tribal population ji achanti they are part of this rich diversity but it was recognized that tankar situation ta different achi au tanku deal kariba pai approach ta bi amku different adopt kariba ku padibo basically dita approach bisay re kuha gala isolationist approach jaha ki veria railway dei thile au gote approach achi amaro assimilationist isolationist approach re kono je jemiti achi se semiti thau jemiti ki veria railway bahut kaam karichile amaro mandala district madhya pradesh re bega tribes bega tribes achi ta upare kaam karichile chatisgarh ro kavardha district re bi achi se kono kahile je tribal manan ku tangaro preservation kariba pai amaku swatantrata dion deba katha preserve tribal identity and their way of life se mane jemiti chalu chanti aja kal ro se mane chalu kintu assimilation amara assimilationist approach ki model ja ki ghure au thakar baba advocate karithile se kouthile tribes ku mainstream ku nei ki aso se mane pindhibe kapda jemiti samaste pindhu chanti patho padibe office jibe mainstream एटा गोटे डिफरेंस अछि एंड दैट इज व्हाई मजुमदार्स मॉडल एडवोकेटेड दैट द मेन स्ट्रीम एंड ट्राइब्स कैन लर्न फ्रॉम ईच अदर कल्चर लीडिंग टू बेटर क्वालिटी ऑफ लाइफ आउ गोटे थर्ड अप्रोच आसीला प्राय एटा बेसिकली ट्यू अप्रोचेस किंतु मजुमदार गोटे थर्ड अप्रोच नै कि आसीले जे ट्राइब्स रु मेन स्ट्रीम लर्न करबो मेन स्ट्रीम रु ट्राइब्स लर्न करबो but in reality mainstream kaharu learn kariba pai ready nahi this is just you see what have the mainstream tried to adopt it we are not preserving our resources we are not conserving we are not leading a sustainable life because mahatma gandhi said nature is sufficient for man's need but not for man's greed our our mainstream society kon karuchi sabu kichi nijo greed pai karuchi nijo need pai to bahut achi amo pakare so you know these are different kinds of approaches further taking the ethnic relations in india we will try to have a focus on tribal context milton ginger in 1997 got a framework dele and he said that a society is built out of formal equal ethnic groups got a society je achi we'll go on to the next slide we'll take up the next slide is built up from a formally equal ethnic group he also said that major national cultural group and other ethnic communities separated by highly permeable boundaries everyone is highly separated by permeable boundaries and ethnic groups have 
can be strongly oriented towards an outside society one or more ethnic groups disadvantaged within larger society and that is that in india also you will find there are several ethnic groups and some of the ethnic groups are disadvantaged now these models or typologies what we see they no society can completely fit the model there will be permeable boundaries there would be overlapping so there are these ethnic relations which are not only about cultural differences kintu there are lot of factors which take into consideration that influence jahar prabhav paduchi amaro culture upar similarly what i said you that two broad possibilities which take place when ethnic communities live in close proximity jebe dita ethnic communities akho pakhare rahuchanti amaro dita probable probable uh, aspects gudako or facts gudako jaha hei paribo assimilation and dissimilation assimilation kon hochi a process of boundary reduction when members of two or more societies or ethnic groups are there tankor boundary ta reduce hochi and jodi process ta successful hochi there is no major social and cultural differences tanko bhitore kichi major social cultural differences rahibo nahi because it is absorbing our dissimilation kon hochi intra societal differences are maintained differences will be maintained and you will find that they are created around sub cultural groups here the groups dynamics remains very strong and very active and both these concepts of assimilation as well as dissimilation this is a ongoing process it is a continuous process and they are reversible also so ginger has given various around uh, more than 10 around 20 variables pakka pakki se deichi that affect the extent and speed of assimilation and these variables variables how will increase or reduce how will the variables increase or reduce the rate of assimilation and dissimilation in a particular ethnic group so he has made assimilative influences mixed or neutral neutral influences dissimilative influences a detailed study has been done by him so we have we are just trying to understand the basic concept of the term assimilation and dissimilation now if we go to the next slide we will see that there have been certain theoretical perspectives in ethnic conflicts so there there is this horowitz concept which was there in the year 1998 and then there was michael brown who has done deep studies in the year 1997 so we will gradually uh, see and understand this which the first one if we are taking the horowitz 1998 who has given us 10 explanations which covers all the theoretical perspectives jete bhi theoretical perspectives achi ethnic conflicts ra say 10 illustrations madhyam re 10 points my explanations madhyam re cover kari chanti se kahi chanti je the self consciousness of the community members gives its unity but at the same time draws boundary with other community self consciousness ame eita ame eita mane kon ame gote group hei jibu and it creates a boundary with other communities so b are this particular say a ame a el hele a ta b sah misibo nahi a gote strong boundary kari debo so thus traditional notions of who we are and who others are lead to conflict jebe ame koiba je we are this they are this the conflict starts ancient hatreds produce conflicts ancient hatreds bapa oja kaloru hatred chali chi simple example gote desho anyo desho sah ancient time ru hatred chali chi so conflicts are result of long standing hatreds and they become part of collective memory मु गोटे देश रसिंदा मुझे देश को अन्य देश को भल पाए ना कल मोर नेक्स्ट जेनेसन भी जी आसो से भी सही देश को भल पाइब ना कहीं कहीं गोटे कलेक्टिव मेमोरी प्रोसेस टा है सिमिलरली मैं
similarly when we see ethnic clashes is a cultural clash ame jebe choto thilu doordarshan re news asu chila pray north east re ethnic clash hochi ye gote tribe gote tribe so clash hochi ebe eta bartaman kami jaichi ki bartaman bilkul hi nahi kintu agore thila ago kalo re thila particularly i remember when i was studying in school so different communities have different systems what is sacred to one is profane to others tolerance nahi more jaha achi seita more importance achi sacred achi and then that leads to ethnic clashes similarly jebe ame modernization bisoy re kahibo modernization brings about ethnic conflict why modern values mo kahili french revolution american war for equality liberty fraternity these are incompatible with traditional values simple example indian society ro example niyo amaro traditional role of a woman is very different from ajiro modern day role got a generational shift chali chi conflict ho chi ghare ho chi ma ro jiyo saha sasuro bahu saha bhai ro bhouni saha kahi kahi ki ए जो मॉडर्नाइजेशन कॉन्फ्लिक्ट क्रिएट एंड सिमिलरली देयर इज एन ओपन कंपटीशन फॉर रिसोर्सेस व्हिच वर अर्लियर मार्क्ड फॉर अ पर्टिकुलर सेक्शन दैट कैन लीड टू कॉन्फ्लिक्ट सो एथनिक कॉन्फ्लिक्ट इज आल्सो कॉज्ड जेबे हमरो आर्थिक कंपटीशन होची बिटवीन एथनिकली डिफरेंशिएटेड सेगमेंट्स ऑफ द वर्किंग क्लास सो you see that there are several movements that son of the soil will get jobs while outsiders will not get india re amaro gote state achi maji maji re hue na jebe bi eta amaro state re khali amari lokon ko ame job deba bahar ku deba ni tanku bahari deba bahut time news re ase eta suni thiba i don't want to take any names so seita kon so that is basically ethnic conflict is caused due to economic competition तो लैंड ऑफ द सोइल सन ऑफ द सोइल से कहबो सन ऑफ द सोइल मूवमेंट एटा अछि देन एथनिक नेटवर्क्स आर यूज्ड टू एक्सचेंज गुड्स एंड सर्विसेज वेयर देयर आर ऑफन चीटिंग इन एक्सचेंजेस सो दिस अगेन क्रिएट्स रेस्ट्रिक्स इकोनॉमिक इंटरेक्शन टू देयर ओन एथनिक बार्टर सिस्टम आगो काल रे थिला एक्सचेंज करिबा सिस्टम सो देन व्हाट हैपेंस people will not like to exchange with other community other ethnic group they will do it within their own group then reduction in transaction costs makes it cheaper for people to interact with their own kinsmen while restrict restricting interaction with others but sometimes there is accident in the process when group interacts and the accident leads to conflict between communities निजो कम्युनिटी भितर तो जहा भी अछि सेटलमेंट हेइ जिवो किंतु केबे केबे दरकार पडिले गोटे एथनिक कम्युनिटी बाहर एथनिक कम्युनिटी सब भी इंटरेक्शन करिवो काम पाई कोनोसी भी तांकर इश्यूज पाई किंतु सेही टाइम रे तांकर कॉन्फ्लिक्ट हेबर चांसेस ता भी बडो छि देन elite interests are also the reason for conflicts elite entrepreneurs make use of their ethnic affiliations and cause ethnic conflicts to serve their political and economic interest sabu society re gote ethnic amar elite class re se elite class bi ethnic conflicts srushti karuchi they make an elite entrepreneurs and make use of their ethnic affiliations and cause conflict so there will be a group of people who will just become entrepreneur from a particular ethnicity and they will go on ruling everyone so theorists using rational behavior have given uh, our innovative approach to study ethnic conflicts and it says that je sabu jagare insecurity ta rahibo sabu group janu nahanti je what will how, how will the other group behave and there is a fear what will be the repercussions so at times you see that it is seen when there is less information uncertainty of communities to choose the best action at time of conflict is with the other communities so it plays a very important aspect and the last one is that ethnic conflicts are based on needs for survival 
गोटे अच्छी सर्वाइवल ऑफ द फिटेस्ट एथनिक कन्फ्लिक्ट कहीं हूँ सर्वाइवल जमी कह गोटे देश अन्न देश सब बड़े लड़ुंत कहीं लड़ुं सर्वाइवल से भावुँ ये मोर जगह नहीं जीव ये भावुँ से मोर जगह नहीं जीव से मोर जगह नहीं गले मुझे रही सो द सलीडारीटी द ग्रुप डेभलप हेल्प द ग्रुप टू कपरेट विथ द मेम्बर्स जमी गोटे देश गोटे देश रुक एकाठी रुहति कहीं बिकज दे हाव टू स्टे टूगेदर इफ द अदर ग्रुप कम्स फ्रम आउट सैड दे अल टूगेदर विल गिव अ रेजिस्टेन्स सो दिस् बर दिन एक्सप्लेनेशन नाइंटीन नाइंटी एट हरो विथ सेटा दे माइकल ब्राउन र से रिव्यू करे विभिन्न आईडेटिफाइड ही रिव्यूड द वेरियस रिजनस वाय दिज एथनिक कन्फ्लिक्ट टेक्स प्लेस एंड व्हाट ही सो इज दैट सिस्टमेटिक एक्सप्लेनेशन विच आईडेटिफाइज जे आम विक रिजनाल न्यासनाल कि इंटरन्यासनाल अथरीटीज थी आईटा सत कथा जेबे भी आम रिजनाल प्रादेशिक सिंपल एक्जामपल स्टेट लेवल कि न्यासनाल लेवल कि रिजनाल लेवल लिडरशिप विक र सिक्योरिटी गोटे इश्यूटा रर मुखियाटा ही विक रे तो रे भी आसो पिटिक पल सो कम्युनिटी जिते भी अच्छा से मैंने ये डेलीमारे सिक्योरीटी डेलीमारे रुहति एंड व्वेन दे रिजर्ट टू मोबिलाइजेसन एंड कनफ्लिक देन दे सेकेंड थिंग विच हि सो इज द डोमेस्टिक एक्सप्लेनेशन विच हि से दि इम्पैक्ट अफ न्यासनालिजम इंटर एथनिक रिलेसन Impact of democracy. They have done it before. See, conflict. People want to have equal uh, rights, equal privileges, equal life. And the third most important cause is perpetual explanation that focus on false histories that communities have about themselves and others. So someone has given you false history that he is your enemy, he is your enemy, he is your enemy, and you just read that. So this false. history that perpetual explanation goes on creating one of the important reasons for ethnic conflict now there have been uh, conflicts in india there have been various causes there have been various effects we'll go to the next slide so there have been various causes and effects as per sahani tribal conflicts have been taking place with other tribal communities tribal conflicts with non tribal so tribal with other tribal tribal with non tribal tribal with state agencies including police and military this is what sahani has identified three kinds of conflicts however there has been major issues of tribal and non tribal conflict land issues जल जंगल जमीन वी आर डिस्कस्ड इन द लास्ट क्लास लैंड इज वेरी इंपोर्टेंट फॉर ट्राइबल सर्वाइवल से मैंने गोटे जनरेसन रू अन्य जनरेसन अजा काल रू बापा काल रू व्हाट डू दे डू लैंड अच्छी चाष करती खाई बंच रही लैंड टा पड़े गले कौन हे पैसा से मैंने रखी पारे नहीं पैसा दे मद पी नेक्ट जेनेसन रोड रे बस थी ना स्लम्स बस आउ लैंड कौन लैंड गोटे स्केर्स नैचुरल रिसोर्स अच्छी आउ कॉलोनियल पीरियड रे कौन है ट्राइबल लैंड ताकू ऑफन कम्युनली ओन्ड रैदर देन इंडिविजुअली ओन कम्युनिटी ताकू ओन करमें कॉमन प्रॉपर्टी रिसोर्स सीपीआर विषय में कौन हाव एवर अंडर कलोनियल लॉ लैंड हैड टू बी ओन्ड इंडिविजुअली आउ ट्राइबल लैंड वाज एलिएटेड एंड अनफर्चुनेटली कौन है आमर देश आजादी है जी, है जी भी आमर ट्राइबल लैंड एलिएशन टा चली सेटलिंग ऑफ आउटसाइडर्स ऑन ट्राइबल एरियाज सो दिस इज आल्सो वन थिंग इन मेनी स्टेट्स जमी झारखंड अच्छी त्रिपुरा अच्छी ट्राइब्स हैव बिकम अ माइनोरीटी ट्राइब माइनोरीटी है कहीं बाहर लोक आसी 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 बस ले ट्राइबल ही रही ना आज आम केतोटी स्टेट्स अच्छी से बुलाक जीव स्टेट कैपिटल रे बड़ बड़ ट्राइबल नेम अच्छी एयरपोर्ट रहा ट्राइबल रही एयरपोर्ट रू बाहर सब लुहा पथर ट्राइबल स्टाच्यू मान अच्छा कि ट्राइबल लोकटा ही तो सीटी ना सो सेटलींग अफ आउटसाइडर्स अन् ट्राइबल लैंड 
देन वी हैव फोर्स्ड माइग्रेशन ऑफ ट्राइब्स फॉर लेबर कॉलोनियल समय रे ब्रिटिश काल रे प्लांटेशन पे फोर्सिबली ट्राइबल्स मान को तांको कम्युनिटी रु तांकर नेटिव लैंड रु धरी की से माने अन्य जगह को नहीं गले काहे की ट्राइबल माने चीप लेबर थी एंड द लोकल पॉपुलेशन कंटीन्यूज टू बी इनडिफरेंट इफ नॉट होस्टाइल टू दिस कम्युनिटीज एंड पॉलिटिकली ए कम्युनिटी टा मार्जिनलाइज सेक्शन है की रहिला पर्टिकुलरली हमर आसाम रो टी गार्डन्स रो ए स्टोरी टा अछि सुनी थिबे आपन माने समस्त डेवलपमेंट प्रोजेक्ट्स एंड स्पेशल इकोनॉमिक जोन्स जहा की गडा जाय छि एसईजेड्स स्पेशल इकोनॉमिक जोन्स सो हमर जो कॉन्फ्लिक्ट स्टेट और ट्राइब्स रो अछि खाली लाइवलीहुड पई नै एटा गोटे क्लैश ऑफ कल्चर मध्य हेइ छि अ कल्चर जोटी देखा जाउ छि की जमी आउ प्रकृति गोटे एसेट अछंती जहा को एक्सप्लॉयट करबा डेवलपमेंट पई आ गोटे ट्राइबल कल्चर अछि जहा देखु छि की एही जमी आउ पर्यावरण परिवेश सह आमे केमिति हार्मोनियसली रही पारिबा हाउ कैन वी लिव हार्मोनियसली इन टैंडम विद लव एंड रिस्पेक्ट कंजर्वेशन एंड प्रिजर्वेशन सो दैट अगेन लीड्स टू प्रॉब्लम्स देन दिस इज व्हाट इज डेवलपमेंट प्रोजेक्ट्स एंड स्पेशल इकोनॉमिक जोन्स नेक्स्ट स्लाइड वी कैन मूव द राइज ऑफ मॉडर्न नेशन स्टेट ऑफ इंडिया पाकिस्तान एंड बांग्लादेश हम ब्रिटिश इंडिया थिला इंडिया पाकिस्तान और बांग्लादेश तीनोटी देश ब्रिटिश इंडिया रो भाग हैले आउ ए जो कॉलोनियल इंडिया थिला आगे सेटा रिलीजन क्राइटेरिया जीटा भाग हैला मुस्लिम मेजॉरिटी पाकिस्तान हैला आउ अन्य अन्यटा जो पार्ट हैला से बांग्लादेश तंकर हैले ए गोटे साइड पाकिस्तान गोटे साइड बांग्लादेश और इंडिया रहिला so boundary of these nations have divided many ethnic communities bahut ethnic term ethnic i have explained you and placed them under different nation states a bahut strong feeling achi je this people of particular ethnic community can get together for example one of the demands of naga separatists is that all nagas unite under one state because nagas are found in india nagas are found in burma and what they are saying is that we all will unite into a one one state similar demands have been made by various separatist groups ago kalo re to northeast re kitte separatist movement guda ko chalu thila bartaman ebe tike sukha shanti achi ame seta sunu na hanti ta pore asila amare state reorganization and federalism in india amaro gote federal system achi vast country डायवर्सिटी टा भिन्न खाना अमर खाद्य अमर परिवेश अमर संस्कृति सबुटा डिफरेंट अछि सो द गवर्नमेंट ऑफ इंडिया रीऑर्गेनाइज्ड आसाम एंड क्रिएटेड नागालैंड इन 1963 मेघालय 1972 मिजोरम यूनियन टेरिटरी इन 1972 एंड फुल फ्लेजेड स्टेटहुड इन 1987 एंड मणिपुर इन 1972 एटा रो आधार कोन थेला अवार्डिंग स्टेटहुड ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ लिंग्विस्टिक दैट इज कॉमन लैंग्वेज किंतु बहुत समय रे होस एई रीजन्स आर इनहैबिटेड बाय मोर देन वन ग्रुप व्हिच कॉजेस प्रॉब्लम कित्ते हमें डिवाइड करिबा ऑन द बेसिस ऑफ लिंग्विस्टिकनेस सो द ट्राइबल एरियाज आर इवन मोर फ्लोरिस्टिक विद अ नंबर ऑफ कम्युनिटीज कोहैबिटिंग द सेम एरियाज सो इट इज इंपॉसिबल टू डिवाइड regions according to one community and grand statehood simple example aji ame koheba sambalpur gote anya state heba bhubneswar gote anya state heba is it possible gote orissa bhitre jeto ti district sabu koheba ame gote gote alaga state that is not possible that is not practically feasible for example in manipur the hills are dominated by the nagas and the plains are dominated by the maitais Nagas want to integrate their area of the state to Nagaland, but the division of Manipur will anger the people of the plain. जो plain रे जो मैंने रोज चांती, आओ छोटा-छोटा smaller non-Naga communities. Similarly, Santhals जो अचांती, Santhal आमे सोनी चु, stay आमर Odisha, Madhya Pradesh, Bengal, Chhattisgarh रे अचांती. आओ, same आमे भी जो दी कोई बे, जो आमे समस्त मिस्ली की अलगा है वो. So this is a very good a complex process. this is a very good a complex process and this has led to these conflicts this is the cause of the conflict administrative arrangements inefficiency insensitivity 
ट्राइबल कम्युनिटीज ड्यूरिंग ब्रिटिश पीरियड तांको कंसीडरेबल फ्रीडम दिया जायतिला तांको अफेयर्स मैनेज करबा पई द ऑटोनॉमी गिवन टू दीस एरियाज अलाउड द ब्रिटिश टू क्लेम दीस एरियाज एज बीइंग अंडर देयर कंट्रोल माने कोनोसी एडमिनिस्ट्रेटिव मशीनरी नाही मिलिटरी रिसोर्सेस नाही ऑटोनॉमी देला और ब्रिटिश कंट्रोल रे से माने रहिले सेपरेटिस्ट ऑफन जस्टिफाई देयर डिमांड फॉर अ सेपरेट नेशन नॉर्थ ईस्ट रे से माने कहउछंती different nation claiming the accession of tribal area so about tribal area ko misai dio north east re abote alaga desh ta srushti karo so this is the reason of conflict and what is the cause you see the ethnicity is the cause over here so the use of armed forces to quell militancy this has also resulted in lot of complaints lot of human right issues hence this has been the seventh point and following this is the lack of economic development the eighth point jitte bhi tribal areas achanti sabu resource rich achanti and they have remained backward amo abhi jo niti ayog achi agre planning commission thila se ta baktavya re koichi je around 80% of total workers both rural and urban are engaged in primary sector of whom 45% are cultivators 37% are laborers and all workers 31.65% cultivators of who 45% agricultural laborers achanti eta dekhauchi je scheduled tribes are essentially dependent on agriculture so they do not have large benefit from growth of service sector it ete badi chali chi it re kete tribals achanti we can count on our fingertips ajib economic development hai nahi incidence of poverty in scheduled tribe states if you see uh, incidence of poverty in schedule among the scheduled tribes not scheduled tribe states sorry sorry scheduled tribe 45.3% in rural area and 24.1% in urban areas eta 2014 ro tribal committee upon ro report achi so we see the economic development a how nine that is also one of the reason of conflict plurality of militant groups ete militant groups achi sabu militant groups achanti tanko sah katha vartha karibaku paduchi so to pacify each groups also is a big challenge which leads to tribal conflict tribals and forest rights eta bi gote bolo issue जे ट्राइबल मान को लैंड एंटाइटलमेंट ना फॉरेस्ट राइट्स एक्ट आसला लैंड एंटाइटलमेंट देवा गोटे इट इज अ रे ऑफ होप बट दिस वाज आल्सो अ मेजर रीजन फॉर आवर कॉज ऑफ ट्राइबल कॉन्फ्लिक्ट्स इन इंडिया देन देर इज कोवर्ड सपोर्ट फ्रॉम एक्सटर्नल एजेंसीज एंड गवर्नमेंट फॉर इनस्टेन्स इट इज एलेज चाइना एड करूला एन एस सी एन को एंड पाकिस्तानी सिक्रेट सर्विसेस आईएसआई मिलिटेंट ग्रुप्स को हेल्प बांग्लादेश हैज बीन आइदर इनडिफरेंट और अनएबल टू कंट्रोल द यूज ऑफ इट्स लैंड एज सेफ हेवेन्स फॉर दीज मिलिटेंट ग्रुप्स हु आर वर्किंग अगेन्स्ट इंडिया ये सब एक्सटर्नाल मान भी आसिक यही कनफ्लिक्ट को बढ़े योगदान दौरान then the role of ruling parties in center and national level politics ame dekhi chu je national parties in center they are uh, they have not been free from blame center uses their power to further their party interest at the cost of instability so it is not uncommon to find the leaders of tribal dominated parties switching sides after a change of power in the center this is again politics no one can do anything for this then there is short sighted decisions and policies both our state government ho ki central government ho tanko short sighted achi tribals ku nei ki policies ku nei ki kahi ki tribal voices ta seti adequately representation ho na hanti au jo tribal culture achi that best people who live there or people of that ethnicity that group of people working for them would know there is an example for instance in orissa decision to grant permission to set up industries in tribal dominated areas without proper consultation has been major cause of unrest 
ओडिसा रे आमे आगे बहुत सुडु थिलो एबे तो एते नाही पॉस्ट को थिला कि एजिटेशन चालीसी काहे कि तांकर इश्यूज ता आगे एड्रेस हेबा परे ही सेठी काम करबा कथा एड्रेस न करे कि काम करिले ई प्रॉब्लम ता रहि छि सो सिमिलरली वी फाइंड सच इश्यूज हैव कम अप इन स्टेट्स लाइक मणिपुर इन स्टेट्स लाइक केरला इन स्टेट्स लाइक छत्तीसगढ़ एंड पर्टिकुलरली दे आर एक्टिव इन झारखंड छत्तीसगढ़ ओडिसा महाराष्ट्र एंड आंध्र प्रदेश विल गो टू द नेक्स्ट स्लाइड यस so all these points that i said covered support from external agencies or the government then the role of ruling parties in uh, center and national level politics short sighted decision jaha ki mo example delhi kerala chatisgarh manipur then the cultural hegemony of the so called mainstream so often the mainstream culture identifies the national culture with their own culture value and lifestyle jaha mainstream ro culture seta hi desh ro culture so that is again a problem because i told you that there is lot of diversity ethnic cultural differences taku recognize na korile puni ei tribal conflicts ta bahar hochi kai ki northeast ro जे ट्राइबल सचंति तांकर खाद्य तांकर रहिबा तांकर कथा कहिबा तांकर संस्कृति आमो एरिया रु भिन्न आमो एरिया रो आउ अन्य एरिया रु भिन्न आ आमको सबुटा को रिस्पेक्ट करबा को पडिबो इट इज जस्ट लाइक दैट वन साइज शर्ट कैन नॉट फिट फिट ऑल इज इट पॉसिबल नो एंड इफ वी विल ट्राई टू डू दैट देन अगेन देयर विल बी कॉन्फ्लिक्ट सो इट्स वेरी वेरी इंपोर्टेंट टू एड्रेस द इश्यूज of ethnicity with respect care and cultural sensitivity cultural hegemony re relates to this kind of issues then you have tribal religion and conversion eta bi gote bahut purana issue ta achi that many tribes have converted to christianity many have converted to hinduism some have even converted to islam so these new identities have often changed the tribal perception of themselves because for instance when they convert to christianity they will get good education awareness health for example many founders of jharkhand movement were christians their education and exposure gave them ability so that they became strong they became empowered they articulated their things however if we see the identities they are excavated the conflict between communities so it's very important जे रिलीजन भी गोटे इंपोर्टेंट रोल टा प्ले सो सेपरेटिस्ट एंड सेशनिस्ट मूवमेंट्स दैट इज द लास्ट वन पॉइंट यू विल फाइंड दैट द कल्चरल एलिएनेशन एंड लैक ऑफ डेवलपमेंट इन ट्राइबल एरियाज हैव रिजल्टेड और प्रोड्यूस न्यूमरस सेपरेटिस्ट एंड सेशनिस्ट मूवमेंट जहा के माने से माने बेले बेले कहंती जे आमो अन्य राज्य गठन हो बेले बेले कहंती आमो अन्य देश गठन हो एंड बहुत ट्राइबल ग्रुप्स पर्टिकुलरली फ्रॉम नागालैंड मेघालय मिजोरम त्रिपुरा अरुणाचल प्रदेश इन द नॉर्थ ईस्ट झारखंड एंड छत्तीसगढ़ आर स्टेट्स व्हिच हैव बीन फॉर्म्ड टू एड्रेस द डिमांड्स ऑफ ट्राइबल मूवमेंट ए जो ट्राइबल मूवमेंट रो डिमांड सेला ताकु एड्रेस करबे पई मध्य प्रदेश रो छत्तीसगढ़ बनिला बिहार रो झारखंड बनिला the longest separatist movement is the naga movement se mane 1926 re gote memorandum british ku dele demanding sovereignty nagaland national council under leadership of angami zapu phizo they started an insurgency and demanded a sovereign naga state so there have been various such organizations naga federal army and other things nscn which i said that there has been uh issues of concern that nscn was being being uh, nscn was being funded by some foreign agencies which again was causing tribal unrest tribal conflict in a, our country so similarly we go on to the next slide that there have been tribal conflicts and basically if you see this conflicts have been naga kukki clashes bodo non bodo clashes tripura and bengali clashes or you find that tripura bengali and bengali and assamese clashes these clash clashes have been taking place and in tripura 
we see the tribal population dropped from 64% in 1847 to 29% in 1971. And Bengali population became 68% of the population. Large tracts of lands were transferred from the tribal hands to the migrants. Relations between the communities deteriorated and violent problems, clashes, they started. So these are the facts in figures. They, what happens when demography of a particular place, particularly the tribal demography, it uh, changes. So these kind of problems are seen. Now, we'll further go on to the next slide. So I'll request the next slide. Yes. Now, when we speak of tribal identity in the modern world, here we see that there are three important characteristics. The first one being the levels of identity, individual, and of that comes our individual as well as community. When we speak of identity as a concept, which occurs in a number of different academic disciplines, both academic disciplines, and this includes particularly psychology, social anthropology, sociology, and political science. Identity can be seen at different level. A more nijara identity, individual identity. Group identity. I mean, just some other roles that identity take on a chi. Jo community the roles that identity take on a chi. So, today I am going to talk about different types of identities. Ta a chi. Jemiti ki political identities, social identities, professional identities. Doctor a chi. Professional identities and doctor a chi. Social social identity he may belong to a particular society or a community. Political identity, he may be affiliated to a particular political ideology or a political party. Hele, amor identity ro a concept to jo achi tar bibinna prakar achi. Jebe ame levels of identity bisare kotha korucho, ame individual au community bisare kohucho. So when we speak of individual identity, it emerges out of unique experiences that individuals have in their life and also they respond to it. So that is why social workers remind themselves often that very client is unique because every individual human being has got an individual identity. So if we see Erickson, who was a psychoanalyst who made seminal contribution towards understanding this concept, described identity as a subjective sense as well as observable quality of personal sameness and continuity paired with some belief in the same in the same kind of or continuity of some shared and world image so we see that this individual identity which is formed express socially in relation to others in society Typically, an individual interacts most of the time. I mean, where I interact with, nijo gharong ko, lokong ko saw interact karu, ki nijo sango manong ko saw, schoolmates saw, friends saw. Aw a interaction ta amo upre, amo identity upre both influence kore. Jemiti ki Mead kohile, sociologist G S Mead differentiated the significant others and the generalized others in the process of emergence of individual identity. So, suppose there is a small baby born in Orissa <coughs> and we take that baby and we keep that baby in Bengal. So, he will grow up and his individual identity will shape up as per culture of that place. Then he won't be able to speak this language. He'll be able to speak that particular language. The significant others are the child's parents while the generalized community at large. Kaiki parents ro significant influence hochi chua manunko opere. Autapore asuchi onyo lokonko influence. Now, when we speak of community identity, individual identity and group identity, they are influenced by community identity and community value, community culture. It is an important factor achi to determine groups' values and beliefs. So there have been various salient features which help us to understand the identities. Now we'll take the next slide. So 
some of the salient features of identities are stable and changing it means that social identities are important because they will fairly remain the same and it is also true that they change over time amar jo samajik paristhiti re ame bado hei chu ajira paristhiti re jo chua mane bado ho chanti that is different so <coughs> no identity remains fixed when there are major changes happening inside the individual and the community in the wider society similarly amar identities are products of self imposition as well as they are created they, they are self created so individual or community ro konosi choice no thai in determining these types of identities often such identities are psychologically socially they are more oppressive in nature so there is social and state coercion in maintaining status quo in these identities au amar sob society re gote power structure achi power matrix achi जहा कि लोक को कंपेल कर कम्युनिटीज एंड इंडिविजुअल्स से रिटेन आइडेंटिटी मन न करे भी आपको सही आईडेटी रिटेन कर फर इनस्टेन्स देर वुड बी दि दलित आईडेटी इन ट्रेडिशनाल इंडिया दैट इज अल्सो अ वे हाउ डू यू सी हाउ डू यू नो व्हाट आर इट्स क्यारेक्टरिस्टिक्स सो अल अफ देम विल हाव अ पर्टिकुलर कैंड अफ सिमिलर क्यारेक्टरिस्टिक similarly there are voluntary change in identity that means that the communities and individuals can change their identities on their own will so they i identify je amaro kono pros achi positive achi negative achi au ta pare se mane stand niantu ta simple example individuals and families may change their religion through conversion to another religion jone a religion follow karuchi taku b religion ku jiba ku hala b religion karina families may migrate from one country to another country get its citizenship and then change their nationality ho chena india ro bahut lok mane foreign ku padai jan india ro nationality ta chhadi dau chan then we have voluntary change in identity so here what it happens in voluntary then involuntary change that is point number 4 so here in this involuntary change in identity we see that sometimes these changes may be forced a community is conquered and made slaves siria re dekhile isi isi jebe sei sabu conflict gora ko chalila sei ti se mane women manu ko slaves bane ki nahi gole when slavery was practiced it was common for conquered people to make captives आगो रे एंड सेल देम इन स्लेव मार्केट्स यू माइट हैव सीन इट इन ओल्ड मूवीज सो देयर हैज बीन दिस इशू सिंस लॉन्ग देन देयर आर मल्टीपल आइडेंटिटीज आल्सो बिकॉज इंडिविजुअल इज अ मेंबर ऑफ मेनी कम्युनिटीज सो आजिकाली आम देखु फेसबुक विभिन्न कम्युनिटी अच्छी यू आर इन योगा कम्युनिटी यू आर इन मॉडर्न जिम कम्युनिटी यू आर इन अनदर डाएट कम्युनिटी सो व्हाट हैपेंस यू हैव मल्टीपल आइडेंटिटीज यू आर टेकिंग फ्रॉम डिफरेंट डिफरेंट प्लेसेस वेरी सिंपल एग्जांपल दिस दैट विल आइडेंटिफाई रेजोनेट विद द यंग जनरेशन नाउ दीज आर द लेटेंट एंड मैनिफेस्ट द आइडेंटिटीज एंड दिस इज अप टू द इंडिविजुअल हु इज कॉन्शियस अबाउट दोस पर्टिकुलर आइडेंटिटीज सो when indians a good example for indians who go abroad suddenly have an intense feeling of indianness when which they felt in india hence the emergence or significance of identities are also situational ame to india re achu india re rahu chu so what happens jebe ame india ro bahar ku jau chu that time we become more cautious of our indianness why because situation has changed then there are identifiers and markers our identifiers are people uh, crystallize around symbols that are used to distinguish from other communities body dress language worship kono si mark rakhibo that would be there then identity crisis and loss of identity 
so this means that the change in condition within the community which may lead to an identity crisis and loss of identity bede bede hue jo identity ta achi jebe assimilation and integration of diverse communities into one homogeneous community hebo sei samay re ame padilu ebe ei system of assimilation identity crisis ta hebo ebong loss of identity ta madhya hebo tapare we will go to the next slide that is the tribal identity crisis and the modern world ame ebe dekhibu tribal identity bisoy re जे क्राइसिस आउ आज कंटेम्पररी सोसाइटी रे कौन इश्यूज गुड़ाक अच्छी सो हियर वी फाइंड दैट ट्राइबल आइडेंटिटी एंड इंडिविजुअल इंडिविजुअल एंड कम्युनिटी मॉडर्न सोसाइटी प्रमोट सोशल आइडेंटिटी बेस्ड ऑन जहाँ जो प्रोफेसनाल कंपिटेन्स अच्छी वेल्थ अच्छी अदर अचिवमेंट अच्छी सो इनफैक्ट वन अफ द मेजर अचिवमेंट अच्छी आम मडर्ण सोसाइटी जे एसक्राइब स्टेटस इंडिविजुअल they achieve status modern day is based on ko gym ko jao cho gold gym ko jao cho so you have a particular identity now tribal society they are less individualistic and have communitarian approach of life jo ki kinship ties ta bahut important achi for material and moral support eta jo study ta karithile professor pfeffer and professor behra दी हजार पांच रहा पब्लिकेशन फैक्ट सो दिस इज नॉट टू से ट्राइबल कम्युनिटीज आर नॉट सोशली डिफरेंशिएटेड डिफरेन्सी नहीं मडर्ण इंडिया मॉडर्न इंडिया रे ट्राइबल कॉन्फ्लिक्ट्स टाकु रिजॉल्व करबा पई आमे जदि देखिबा तो टू अ लार्ज एक्सटेंट इट इज द द सिचुएशन नाउ इज पीसफुल एंड आल्सो व्हाट आई सेड यू दैट देयर इज एसिमिलेशन दैट इज टेकिंग प्लेस सो देयर हैज टू बी अ क्रॉस लर्निंग व्हिच आई सेड इन माय डेलिबरेशन टुडे दैट द मेन स्ट्रीम सोसाइटी हैज टू टेक अप थिंग्स फ्रॉम द ट्राइबल सोसाइटी and the tribal society also has to take up things from the mainstream society to have a sustainable living process and a harmonious living process because today tribals are having interaction with non tribals and non tribals are also having interaction with tribals it's not that each of these segments of the society are living in a isolated fashion so based on the deliberations and discussions that we are having in this chapter this would be the ideal way however there are certain pvtgs who have got their own various pradhikarans to take care of them and there is a absolute good process initiated by the policy makers and the government and various tribal studies experts that is going on to because they are almost on the verge of extinction so there is no question of conflict rather they are at a greater risk but for others what i said tribe non tribe have to has to get to get up then the tribal uh, identity and colonialism that what we see colonialism here we find that indian societies joro jo bhi contact with the western rationality was under colonial rule amar jaha bhi administrative system ho patapada system ho legal system ho sabu tanko values anusai anujai amar hei chi kintu yaro impact that tribal life upre tribal system upre padi chi seita bhinna rahi chi kahe ki administratively ame dekhibu the traditional form of self governance has been replaced by a political system how say it achi got a state capital achi got a national capital achi got a centralized bureaucratic system achi traditional tribal communities were having the process of governance systems which were procedurally very open very participative so this thing has to come and address the issue because if this is not addressed then again there will be a huge problem and that is why this tribal identity and colonialism needs to be taken care of then we have tribal identity and the environment eta ajiro jugore bahut important achi kahi ki ame dekhiba je mountains trees stones are imbued with spiritual powers and actively intervene in people lives at the same time 
the supernatural world of spirits is also an extension of the social world of lineage which i am quoting from baviskar 2004 which says that the populated as it is by the invisible presence of ancestor guardians and evil spirits so the tribal identity is embedded in the natural resources and this is a big problem that tribal relationship with forest is not entirely supernatural many of the food items and energy resources for the tribals are obtained from forest so a delicate uh, balance has to be made between both of these aspects similarly we have the tribal identity in christianity which we dis uh, discussed earlier also with coming in of the uh, colonial rules with the spread of christianity embracement of christianity by the tribes and their upward mobility similarly we have tribals who have adopted hinduism we spoke of ghure a prominent sociologist who called indian tribes as backward hindus many have disputed also on his statements and studies so the ghure model is there which speaks of uh, the tribes as backward hindus and then we have tribal identity and industrialization jete bi natural resources achi से सब जगह रे ट्राइबल सचंती हेले केमिति इंडस्ट्रियलाइजेशन टा ट्राइबल लाइफ को डैमेज न करे की जो ग्रुटलैंड कमीशन रिपोर्ट अछि सस्टेनेबल डेवलपमेंट प्रिंसिपल्स को एम्ब्रेस करे की चलिले हाउ दिस अर्बनाइजेशन एंड इंडस्ट्रियलाइजेशन व्हिच आर टू इंपोर्टेंट फीचर्स ऑफ मॉडर्न लाइफ दैट विल हैव मिनिमम नेगेटिव इंपैक्ट ऑन द ट्राइबल्स दैट हैज टू बी सीन टू अवॉइड द आइडेंटिटी क्राइसिस finally it is the state and nation building that is the british colonial rule was replaced by a very liberal democratic and modern day state and now we have to see that how these modern day rulers are going to embrace the tribes into this particular modern day scenario of state and nation building then we'll go to our last point i'll take another 3 to 4 minutes to cover the last point that is tribal reaction to loss of identity and change ame dekhilu change hela crisis hela tahale tankaro reaction ta kon rahi chi tankaro tini prakar ro reaction ta rahi chi first reaction is being of a deviant behavior so that is different from what most people consider it to be normal so increase in deviant behavior among the tribes that has taken place that is kon ho chi increase in committing theft and robberies tribes have rapidly faced change in their traditional role so for survival these kind of activities they have started getting indulged into for instance british jebe amaro many british government chile se time re rajput rulers rulers ro rajasthan re chile se mane mina tribe were notified as criminal tribes why this is a deviant behavior because there is a loss of identity and there is a change so how how will they adopt themselves when they do not have a livelihood this was one major thing alcoholism you find that it is observed tribal when and women are becoming increasingly addicted drinking 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 disintegration and disappearance of tribal communities tankor population ta kami jauchi mu ebe kahitili last class le अंडमान निकोबार आइलैंड रे गोटे ट्राइब तार गोट्रो लास्ट सर्वाइवर सर्वाइवल खिला सर्वाइवर से मरी गला और तास तांकर भाषा भी और लोप हेई गला देन द रिवाइवलिज्म ऑफ लैंग्वेज एंड कल्चर नाउ द प्रोसेस ऑफ नेशन बिल्डिंग इज सेंटर्ड ऑन द मेजॉरिटी कल्चर एंड लैंग्वेज जहां भी मेजॉरिटी कल्चर अछि लैंग्वेज अछि किंतु खाली ताकू सेंटर करे कि चलिले तो हेबो नि हमें खाली कहबा गोटे लैंग्वेज त सब जगह रे रहू सेटा तो पॉसिबल नहीं ए भलिया डाइवर्सिटी डाइवर्सिफाइड देश रे वी हैव टू रिवाइव देयर लैंग्वेज देयर कल्चर वी हैव टू प्रिजर्व वी हैव टू प्रमोट एंड वी हैव टू सी दैट देयर कल्चरल राइट्स आर ऑलवेज रिस्पेक्टेड एंड टेकन केयर ऑफ नाउ व्हाट वी सी इज फ्यूजन एंड फिशन इन ट्राइब्स so here what we see modern modernization and the democracy has often led to changes in social identity of the tribal people 
many originally distinct tribe they have come forward they have formed tribal unions they have met together but there have also been certain controversies then the process if we see dattare said the process of naming and renaming of tribes by tribes themselves and by the outsiders so this also has been a process attempt in assam to change the name of the tribe by the tribes themselves because they feel that that gives a very derogatory response or a derogatory image to them has been taking place so this is their reaction sometimes they want to keep the same name they want to change the name they want to form a federation they want to have a fusion they want to form a, a trade or tribal kind of union so these are the impacts or you can say tribal reaction to loss of identity and change with this we come to the end of today's session thank you thank you sir so i will yes i'll request madam to thank you thank you sir so i like to summarize the whole session uh in this class we have learned about the concept and differences uh, and inequality principles of equality highlights the discriminated group because of their natural differences we also discussed about the indian context of inequality and differences by dr ambedkar we learned the indian constitution provided socio economic development to the tribal people and uh, the safeguards for tribal we visualize the people popular stereotype about tribes here we discuss the theories and concept of ethnic relations in india we also discuss sahani's cause and effect of conflict in the tribal context such as tribal and non tribal conflict land issues settle outsider on tribal land forced migration etc with some of examples we also learn about the identity its feature and specifically tribal identity and we deeply understand the crisis of tribal identity and the modern world the tribal relations with the loss of identity also described by our resource person so thank you so much for a wonderful class and i extend my thanks to you for giving your valuable time to our students thank you thank you so much thank you so now i like to thanks our technical person hello pratap das hello yes hello. do you have any question uh, yes okay yes. please proceed hmm. uh also my voice is audible hello yes hello my voice is audible yes, Yes, voice is audible. Voice is audible. Ah, sir. Sir, ah, uh, actually there is a question. Ah, uh, the northeast ah uh, uh, tribal conflicts. How yes. the problem come under control? How the problem okay. come under control? The northeast conflicts. Yes. So who who is speaking? May I know your good name, please? Ah, uh, Ramchandra Baji. Okay. Ramchandra Baji. Okay. Okay, so you are speaking about the northeast context. Yeah, how the problem come under control? Yes, there has, been a, yes, there has been a very good study, a very very good uh, do document, and also study made by uh, Professor Varya Elwin, who gave okay. the punch seal, who gave the punch seal uh, policies also, which Pandit Nehru had advocated. So to bring in peace in northeast India. what is very important is to see that uh, we accept and we respect the culture of north eastern people because uh, in my first unit deliberation i said that we are calling them as chinese mongolite tribes chinki so first thing is that we need to respect respect has to come second thing that is very important is that cultural sensitivity they may be eating beef they may be eating pork or they may be eating any kind of thing which the central indian may find it very different but you have to see to it with the same love care and respect and also what we read in this chapter was how can a principle be evolved to accommodate them with the basic concept of giving autonomy 
so that they rule themselves they find solutions to their indigenous problem indigenous solution instead of it coming from the state capital or, or the national capital of course in a federal structure we need to accommodate the national and state interest but we have to accommodate the local indigenous problems in the indigenous solutions for indigenous problems is very important cultural respect is very important and what i spoke about environment so the environment has to first cater to the tribal needs and then to others needs because if environment is not catering to the local needs and it is catering to the needs of the market forces there will be problems so if we basically address these three points i think there would be greater peace and prosperity in that part of country so the yeah <laughs> hello hello yes uh, any constitutional amendment done in the northeast to bring the uh, under control no constitutional amendment already in the first class i have spoken about protective discrimination so those amendments no, are no, already no, no, there not no, no, not only for not only for the over, all over the india that is for the northeast state that's for the schedule yes. 6 for the yes yes pesa is there forest rights act is there protective discrimination is there its implementation is a question how do you implement these things article 15 is there article 14 is there you have to implement it not only in letter but in spirit also both in letter and spirit so what is the 371 hello ha so what is the 371 i am not able to hear you uh, what is the 371 hello hello sir mere baat sunai pad raha hai can you write and send as you as as some students were writing and sending can you write and send me the question send me in writing i can write it so uh, what uh, just right now my voice is audible to you sir aapko sunai de raha hai thank you write write and send me no that is not a problem sir but uh, just uh, i am asking for the, uh, the there is another question there is a number of question regarding the north east what you are telling that the how the home situation is come under control so 371 then ilp ilp inner line permit you are saying hello yes wow wow yes so what do you want to know about inner line permit and article 371 you are asking no you know actually that the 371 within the ilp is a given to protect Article them for the within the and safeguards livelihood opportunities for the local people okay and ilp is inner line permit yes if you go to for certain what? states yes i have been to nagaland i had to procure yeah, a yeah, yes. uh, 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 sir sir I, actually i have faced that problem so i am telling actually i have uh, well, it was not known to me and uh, when i uh, moved to the north east i faced that problem so why didn't you take a ilp from the centers in delhi and kolkata okay it meet the other brother what is that provision provision is that certain states i have visited arunachal pradesh and i have visited yes. uh, i have visited kohima nagaland so i have okay. to go to these two states i went to their offices in kolkata and delhi either of the place uh-huh. you can go and you have to get yeah. a form filled and approved from them from i i I, 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 uh, i i know that procedure sir that is not a problem so i know the procedure but, but i actually i want to know that why that ilp provision is given to the two state like the arunachal pradesh and nagaland why it is given you are asking yeah, it yeah, is yeah. basic yeah it is basically given to safeguard their culture and the tribal population because you see i gave you an example of manipur where the yeah. tribal population went on declining and the other population which came from outside it went on increasing creating an 
balance so these states are very fragile they have lot of ethnic diversity and in order to protect the ethnic diversity and to also see that there are no conflicts this ilp provision has come up because i told you during british india 1927 nagaland people requested for an autonomy to have a different country which did not take place so there was lot of insurgency even during the british rule after the british rule naga accord was also done in order to bring peace and stability because today we cannot say that okay we give nagaland independence and it becomes an independent country no that is why india has adopted a federal state concept what i said you about what ambedkar ji has said where there will be political equality and we have to look into socio economic equality so that is why this i think some internet issues is there thank you so thank you thank you sir for your questioning and uh, i like okay. to thanks to everyone who joined this uh, session uh, thank you prakash for your support thank you ma'am thank you ma'am thanks uh, to our resource person for an wonderful uh, session but uh, i think he is not uh, Okay. Shall we wait for some minutes or? Uh, technically, to. Uh, Sir, call question. Okay. Hello. Yes. Na na, sir. Doubt uh, doubts are clear. He gave you a be. सांकर लैपटॉप बैटरी डेड ही गला तो से आ कनेक्ट करबा ले ठीक थैंक यू एवरीवन बाय बाय हैव अ नाइस डे थैंक यू मैम